How do we listen to the universe when the vast expanse of space offers no sound in the traditional sense? In the vacuum of space, where there is no air to carry sound waves, we turn instead to a different kind of listening, one that transcends our natural senses. This is where radio telescopes come into play. These colossal instruments, often appearing like massive satellite dishes pointed skyward, are designed to detect radio waves, a type of electromagnetic radiation, invisible to the human eye but rich with cosmic information. Unlike optical telescopes that capture starlight, radio telescopes can hear the hums, bursts, and whispers that the universe sends our way across time and space. These signals come from some of the most enigmatic and extreme objects in the cosmos. Pulsars, for example, are rapidly spinning neutron stars that emit beams of radio waves at astonishingly regular intervals, like cosmic lighthouses. Quasars, on the other hand, are ancient, hyper-luminous galactic cores powered by supermassive black holes. They shine brightly in the radio spectrum and tell tales of a younger, more volatile universe. Even the faint cosmic microwave background, the residual radiation from the Big Bang itself, is detected not with traditional telescopes, but through these specialized radio instruments. This faint glow, uniform across the sky, is a snapshot of the infant universe, a whisper from a time before stars had even formed. But listening to the universe isn't just about understanding its birth or marveling at its bizarre creations. It's also about asking the ultimate question, are we alone? Radio telescopes are a cornerstone of the search for extraterrestrial intelligence, SETI. They scan the skies for any artificial radio signals, listening for patterns or transmissions that might suggest intelligent origin. While no confirmed alien message has been received, the very act of listening, of paying attention to the subtle signals the cosmos emits, reflects humanity's deepest curiosity. By mapping the sky in these invisible signals, astronomers are not merely observing the universe. They are decoding it. They're translating the silence of space into a symphony of data, one that speaks of distant galaxies, ancient explosions, and perhaps one day, voices beyond our own.